They expect double digits. And they just should write two songs every hour. How many hours are there? Eight hours? Should be at least 16 summons. That's how they used to do it to us. That's how we got that number 16. Okay, because my maker song is here in Manhattan. What goes on in Queens, Brooklyn, and the Bronx, I don't care no more. I care what happens here. I care what my agents do. Right now it's 10. Do 10 tickets. No problem. Write 10 tickets every day. Was there pressure, a lot of pressure to, to do 10? Well, it, it, it was, yeah, I mean, it was, it's the center, it's the centerpiece of the operation. There's, there's nothing else. It's generate cash for the city, write tickets. If you don't write tickets, you're not doing your job. So that uh, is Mark Conti. Mark Conti uh, used to work for the Department of Sanitation. He says he's a whistleblower and that uh, there was a quota. There was a lot of pressure to make a quota and write a certain number of tickets. Now, right now we're still working and putting this uh, story together. We have edits to do. We have other interviews to add to this, including interviews with some business people who feel as though this quota led to them getting unfair or unwarranted uh, uh, summonses for littering. They say they, it was kind of like a shakedown because they say that uh, their, their sidewalks were clean. They didn't deserve the ticket. We should add here that the Department of Sanitation uh, refutes the story. They deny that there is any quota or any pressure on their enforcement agents to write tickets. So we're working on this. We're still putting this piece together. You'll be able to see it tonight, the full investigation, uh, tonight at 530 on Channel 7. For now, I'm Jim Hoffer, 7 on your side, investigates.